Hello everyone. I hope all of you are doing good, healthy and safe. Once again, I would like to welcome you to the online class session initiated by Little Angels School 2077. On the last session, we were discussing about introduction to computer. We have gone through different parts of computers like what is the definition of computer, the working stage of computer, application areas of a computer and we were also discussing about some of the different features of a computer in brief. Today we are going to learn about the features of a computer in detail. So let us go through the features of a computer. So what are the special features of a computer? Why do humans need computers or what are the Necessity of using computers at our daily life. Now, a computer is a man-made machine which needs to be instructed to perform its tasks. Even though it is a man-made machine, it possesses some specific features which are far more better than of humans. Some of the special features of a can computer can be discussed in detail as high speed, storage, accuracy, automation, versatile reliability and consistency, diligence etc now let us go through all these features of a computer one by one the first feature of a computer is high speed a computer can work with a very high speed it can process millions of instructions within a fraction of a second the speed of a computer is measured in megahertz or gigahertz there are numbers of terms which are used in understanding the speed of a computer like millisecond microsecond nanosecond picosecond etc I have listed different sorts of measurement units of speed of a computer like millisecond, microsecond, nanosecond, picosecond, etc. on my slide. You can go through the slide and get the details about all these terms. The second features of a computer is storage. A computer can store a large amount of data and instruction in its memory permanently. The storage capacity of a computer is measured in terms of bits to store a character on the keyboard a computer need 8 bits which is equal to one byte whenever you type a certain key on the keyboard they are stored in the form of binary digits 0 and 1 to insert a character or to enter a character in computer's memory or to save the character in computer's memory a computer need or require one byte the third Feature of a computer uh, I have discussed here is accuracy. By the word accuracy, you can understand a computer always produces accurate result. If the instruction given and the programs running on a computer is correct, a computer always produces 100% accurate answer. We can trust on the output given by the computer in a sense that it always produces 100% correct output. If the instruction given to the computer is wrong, or the programs are not running properly inside a computer system, then a computer sometimes produces irrelevant result, which is termed as garbage in, garbage out. And it is the condition when a computer fails to provide correct output to the user. The next feature of a computer is automation. Automation is the features of doing work automatically. Computer processes its tracks automatically using certain programs and produces the output. Once correct data and instruction are given to the computer as input, it processes those input automatically by using relevant programs and produce the output as desired by the user because of which it is also regarded as the automatic machine or automatic calculating device. Now let us go to the next feature of a computer which is called versatility or versatile a computer is capable of doing many different types of work at a time computer is versatile in nature as it can do multitasking at the same time multitasking means doing many types of work at the same time we can open and work on multiple applications or software at the same time for example you can work on any software like working on midas portal and at the same time you can play music as well if you are bored with midas portal or you if you are bored with playing music you can also play games at the same time just resuming the other applications 
Also, at the same time, you can open a web browser or you can print any stuff or secret at the same time because of which computer is termed as a versatile machine. The next feature of a computer is reliability and consistency. By the term reliability and consistency, I hope you can understand reliability is the feature of a computer which says that computers can be trusted. Reliability is an attribute of any computer related component, either software or hardware or a network that consistently performs according to its specification. A computer is a reliable machine as it gives consistent result for similar set of data. If we give same set of input any number of time, we will get the same result. Computer performs all the tasks automatically, it performs tasks without manual intervention. It processes data with high accuracy without any mistake. That is reliability and consistency feature of a computer. Now the next feature of a computer is diligence. Diligence is the capacity of computer of performing repetitive tasks without getting tired. A computer is free from tiredness, lack of concentration, fatigue, etc. Therefore, it can work for hours without creating any errors with same efficiency. Even though it processes millions of instructions at a time or instruction millions of time. It is a comparative, there is a comparative differences between human and computer in this sense. Because it is a property of a computer which says computer never get tired. Even though it does millions of instructions millions of times, but humans get tired after doing certain sorts of activities. Okay, these are all about the features of a computer. I hope you will go through my video to understand about different features of a computer in detail. If you could not understand all these features in detail by looking at the video, I will be posting a PDF for file and also a PowerPoint presentation format of the same. For your assistance, I hope all of you will go through the video, all of you will go through the PDF file and a PowerPoint presentation file to complete your assignment about the related chapters. All of you stay at your home, be safe and secure. Thank you very much.